Sims 4 is one of the best games ever, and I've always wanted to make a Sims 4 series, so today is the day, so I'm going to go in Willow Creek and create me a new Sim. I cannot wait to make a new Sim. Uh, it's going to be a woman, because I want to look kind of similar to what I hope to look like when I get older a little bit, so let's go ahead and get started. So she's female, she's in a young adult, I'm going to change her uh style of walking change her voice real quick actually I'm gonna um, change it back real quick but first we're gonna change the setting so I'm changing the audio real quick and I'm gonna turn it up and there we go now I'm gonna change her voice to a sweet voice Hold on. sweet right there now I'm gonna turn it up now I'm going to start editing her look and making her look a little bit of what I hope to look like when I become an adult. So we're going to change her cheeks. So I think I'm going to go with these cheeks because they're really cute and I just like the way it makes her face look. So we're going to go with these right here, I believe. I think these are the ones that I should go with. And now I want to change... So now I'm going to click on these cheeks because I'm just swapping through cheeks to see which ones look best. Now we're going to go and try, I guess, and take her hat off. Now we're going to change her skin color. So now I'll change her skin tone to a darker color. Now I'm going to focus on her mouth. I think I'm just going to make these lips a bit bigger and then we're going to keep adjusting it a little bit because I'm still trying to figure out exactly how I want it. So actually let me, I need to go out of this real quick. Now let me focus on the eyes. So I think I want her eyes to be brown. So now let's change her eyebrows and I'll probably make her eyebrows black. And now let's change her hairstyle. So I think I'm gonna do a brown color because I really like brown. I think I might change her cheeks or her jaw again because uh, something's missing and I'm gonna adjust her cheeks and her nose so I can get it the perfect size maybe her eyebrows her eyes down and just keep adjusting her face so now I've got the cheeks kinda how I want it so I'm gonna probably adjust it just a bit more and keep fixing a few tweaks let's keep adjusting her face making it a little smaller and just get it how I want it. Um, I think I'm okay with her face look for now. I'm gonna keep adjusting things, her nose, and let's see what else I need to fix. I think I'm gonna go with the mouth and change that up again. Make it a little bit bigger and get it how I want. So I almost have a face how I completely want it. So I think I'm okay with the mouth. Now we're gonna go back to the eyes. But now I'm gonna go to the cheeks. I think I'm okay with how she looks. So I do wanna fix her hair and try and give different styles for each day. I do have a few um, different CC hairstyles, but a lot of it is from like different game packs. I really like this hairstyle from, I think, um, Seasons. That's where I got this one, or either Get Famous. I'm pretty sure it's Seasons, though. So now we're going to let's see what other hairstyles. I like this one. It's really cute. Plus, I like the brown hair color. I just thought it was different, and I really just like brown hair. So I don't think I want any hats, so let's go to uh, accessories, get her some earrings, make her look really cute. I'm not sure what her name's going to be yet, so hopefully by the time I'm done creating and putting her clothes on, I'll know what to name her. 
So now let's go back to makeup and see what kinds of makeup and lipstick and stuff like that I should put on her. I don't really care too much for eyeshadow, so I'm more into like fixing lipsticks and lip glosses or whatever to put on my stem. I'm more into that other than the like eyeshadow. So now let's go to adjust her size, make her a little bit bigger, make her waist a little bit bigger, and her shoulders a little wider and her legs a little bit bigger. Adjust her legs a bit more. And then I think I'm going to start putting her clothes on. So I'm getting her, I think I got the legs how I want it. Now I'm going to make it a little bit smaller just so I can keep adjusting everything the way I want it. Now let's keep adjusting her body. And just now I think I'm going to focus on the clothing and her shirts. Like I've always loved Sims 4. Like I really don't play it all the time, but I did want to get some gameplay in. And I was introduced to the game probably like last year and I've been in love with it since then. Like I wasn't really into Sims 4. Well Sims This is a cute little top. I like this. This one right here the purple, let's change her pants. Those are cute, that skirt is cute, the shorts. Like I said, a lot of these pants and stuff are from like packs. Like, uh, Get Famous was not a bad pack, but it, I thought it would be better. I feel like I would have rather had cats and dogs instead of that because the world's not very big, it's only a few places. It's just not all I thought it would be, but I mean, I already have it now, so I just, I mean, not much I can do now. These pants right here are really cute, and now let's change her shoes because I want something really cute. Probably like these right here, they look pretty good. Now let's go to her formal wear and I wanted to have on like probably a nice pretty dress. Something that's gonna pop and stand out. Not this too short. Um and I'm not sure what I want her to wear. And I do have a plan for the Sims 4 gameplay. I do want her to have family, meet different people, um, she is a young adult, so she's probably like, if I had to put her at an age, it'd probably be like, she's 22, um, just getting out of college, I guess, 22 is a good age, and she is now trying to discover who she wants to be and get her life together. For her activewear, um, I actually thought that was my nightwear, so I had to go back and change her shirt because I actually thought it was the nightwear. Now we're going to change her into some shorts, probably black. Now let's change her shoes into a nice pretty color. Now off to her nightwear, we're actually, I think this is, this is not actually that bad. Um, so I like her activewear, it's pretty cute. Oh, I got to change her shoes. Um... I'm not sure. I think the these colors they look like Adidas. So now let's go back to our nightwear. So um, I don't think I really should change her hair. Let's go and change her night outfit to something that looks more comfortable. So maybe um, like a tank top or something. Now let's change her pants. Those shorts are really cute, so maybe these and just the regular all black, kind of grayish color. So I'm not sure what I'm going to do for her party wear, but um, I'm going to change her hairstyle. That is really cute, but she looks older a little bit with that hairstyle, but it's still really cute.
I do want to keep that, and I think it makes her skin look good with her skin. I really think this sim is like really cute, so I was just scrolling for other to see what other hairstyles I like. But I think I'm just gonna stick with the one I chose the first time and change her dress. Probably this purple is really cute, and it makes her look young. Now let's change her shoes. Now, the good thing about the swimwear is, like, with the Seasons pack, you get a lot of different swimwear. And I think the Seasons is a really good one. And another pack I really enjoyed was Dine Out. Actually, it's kind of underrated, I think. But I really enjoyed it because, I mean, you get to go on dates. And it's, like, really fun. It's, like, you always have something to do. And you can make your own restaurant. And this is from, this, um, swim outfit is from the Seasons Pack. And a lot of the different hairstyles that you guys see, I just really love. And as I said, I do have a few CCs in here, uh, custom contents, hairstyles, and stuff like that in this game. But I'm trying to focus more on the things that are already in Sims. So before I move to the hot outdoors um, outfits, I'm going to change her hair. So when it's hot outside, I think I should pick out an outfit that doesn't make her hot. You know, something that's going to look comfortable and something I would really want to wear in real life or something that looks like you're not actually going to be burning up. So I think the uh, cute dress might be cool. Um, That's really cute. It is. It really is. I really like that dress. Red it looks good on her. It's like a cherry red, maybe. Now let's change her hairstyle to those cute buns. They're really cute. Now when it's cold outside, we can change her outfit. Um, this more for a Christmas swap, so I'm going to change her pants, probably. I really like these. They're really cute. Like I said, a lot of this stuff came from the Seasons pack and I just think it's one of the best packs because Get Famous is not bad but I would have preferred to have spent that on something else. But I think I'm going to change her into that little cute coat right here like it's a coatish looking dress it's really cute. Now let's change her name. So I'm not really sure what to name her. I think Madison Rain is really cute. Um, I really like that last name Rain. I just think it sounds really cool. And if you don't know, that is actually a wrestler. So I'm just using names I thought were really cute. So I've never focused on a sim that knew how to cook. So I wanted to be like a chef. Um, I want her to be a dancer. I, I will leave a uh, this pack in the description. It's a um a different pack. It's um the more traits mod. Um I think you guys will enjoy it because it adds more traits and options for your sims and so they can do different things. And I really love this pack. So she cooks, she writes, she's an artist, and she's a natural cook. That's some good traits right there. So I think she looks pretty good. I'm pretty satisfied. I mean, hopefully I look this young when I get older. Because I just really like how she looks. So I'm going to randomize um, her picture as soon as I rename this. So Madison Love. Exclamation mark. Now... Um, not that one. This one looks pretty good. The good thing about the Sims 4 update, things, like, the screen loads a lot faster, I think. So, it doesn't take as long for you to get to the place you need to go, like, traveling and stuff like that with the Sims. That's one thing I really like. And it is a love day. So, I'm gonna go and escape. I'm not sure what pack I got this skating rink from, but I want to say it was Seasons as well. 
So thank you guys for watching my first episode of The Sims 4 Gameplay. And more episodes should be out soon. I can't wait to go on more adventures. And thank you guys for watching. Bye!